Hi, and welcome to Ask the Expert. Our expert today is Martez Layton. Hi, Martez, how are you? How are you doing, Tawana? I am fantastic. I am so glad to have you back here on the show. It's so good to see I mean, It's been a while. Yes, it has, but I'm definitely so glad to be here and just looking forward to just you know, just encouraging and just helping those that may find themselves, you know, dealing with some marital challenges. Absolutely. And, you know, it's so funny. When I called you and told you we had these questions, you were the first person that came to mind. So I wanted to make sure that I got on your schedule as soon as possible. So Thanks. here is your question. Okay. I earn more money than my husband and I feel resentful towards him. Okay. We have only been married six months. We are both in our 40s, and when we married, I believed in him and all his efforts to better himself. But the rose-colored glasses are now off, and I see that he has no ambition. How do I save my marriage? Okay. Now, that's a really great question, Tawana, but the first thing that stands out to me when I hear her say this is, is they've only been married for six months. And for them to be both 40 years old, um, then the question also comes to, did they have premarital counseling? Did they go through any premarital coaching? Because it sounds like there was no expectations or goals actually written prior to the marriage. And what I'm hearing her say is, how do I save the marriage? Where at 40 years old for the man, he could be in an emotionally transitioning place to really you know, when they talk about how you go through that transition, you know, as a man or sometimes even as a woman. So I would want her to really ask the question first before she asks, how can I save my marriage? Is also ask, what is my husband's direction for the future? It doesn't seem like that question was definitely asked. So I would definitely ask him in a professional setting so she can have a third party to really find out, you know, where is he going? Because for her to fall in love with him and marry him, and she seems to be an ambitious woman, that kind of tells me there had to be something there also in him. And so also what caused that to go away? You know, so it's more than just asking how do I save my marriage. I would also be asking her, you know, how can you save the future, your future, and his future? And then we find out together is that the same future. Um, because to focus on what he's making, um, to me, that shouldn't necessarily be the priority if he has a clear direction. You know, if he has, if he has a clear direction, a clear focus on what he's trying to do, but he's had some setbacks, and she may not know those setbacks, then it's very important to find out emotionally what's going on within, within him first before you just either run away or walk away. So, um... That's the thing that I would say first, not just from a standpoint of how can I save my marriage, but looking at it first to see, to get an understanding of where's the marriage even headed. 